everybody, what's going on? Your host, AMF1534, here. Welcome back. Let's play some more Gran Turismo 2. And uh, here we are in the Euro League. Knocked out these first two, got some awesome prize cars for it, and now we're going to finish it off in style. Hopefully, and it's, it's the Rome circuit. We've had problems here before, but I'm not planning on it because we are still vastly overmatched here. We are, we are way above what everybody else is doing here. However, that doesn't necessarily mean anything. I mean, we had a we had a nice little a nice little bit of competition in the uh, in the last race that we did. So uh, there's a, there's always that possibility that they can try to you know ruin my hopes and dreams by giving me a second place finish. But they won't because that would be that would be too easy. So away we go. I'm gonna just totally destroy these guys. The nice thing about this race is that there are a couple areas where there are very long straightaways and that's going to be key if I can stop spinning out like a dick. Just get control of my damn car. Get control of your car. Put the car in the garage. There you go. I don't like that turn. That is my least, one of my definitely my least favorite turn in this race for sure. For shiggity. However, it definitely got through that a little bit easier than I thought I was going to. I thought it was going to be a little more, uh, a little more of a problem, but it was not. There we go. Yeah. I hate that they're making us do three laps for these, by the way. I mean, they, they could have easily done two and it would have been fine, but... I mean, I guess I, I, guess I understand it. I mean, you, these cars do have a lot of horsepower, so... I, I, I can understand the fact that they're, you know, having us do three just because of how quickly we're blazing through this but at the same time I I would rather do two I would rather do two I think that you could uh, I think you could have a, a very a very nice length race with two laps but I get it you know they want they want to give the they want to give the opposition a chance they want to give them a chance to be able to compete against me who is clearly just you know pulling out their insides with a tuning fork and then uh, spraying it with bronze, with uh, with like some uh, bronzing suntan lotion, and then uh, feeding it to a cow. Here we go. Just going to uh, go right on around here. Ah, there we go. <coughs> All right. Just going. Ah, there we go. Lovely. God, I hope that the Beavers don't win this game. I will be so pissed if they do. I just want them to lose, and then go home, and then then everything will be back to normal again. Then we can be like, ha, you guys still fucking suck, because we didn't win. Of course, they can say the same thing, because we didn't win either, but we weren't we weren't expected, you know, to to go all the way to the title. That was like their big thing the whole year. Like, no, we're going to win the title this year. Oh, shit. See, maybe this, maybe this is why they have us do three laps. When I do stupid shit like this, again, in the same place that I always do it. God, I just can't have a clean race anymore, can I? I mean, we're still winning. We're still, we're still going to win this, but it'd be nice if I could just <coughs> not do that for once. Thank God for this silhouette skyline. Leaving him in a trail of black dust. Let's just increase that lead all over again. And... Did they force a double play? Hell yeah, they did. That's what I'm talking about. It's really hard for me to concentrate on two things at once sometimes. I I actually was really good at that when I was in the elementary school. They they tried to put me in the ta that tag program, the old talented and gifted thing. But they had me do a test, and like the test they had me do was fucking stupid. It had like nothing to do with anything like all the all the tag stuff was like it was all math it's like why are you like if, I, if I'm talented and gifted why are you putting me in like just a math course and they're giving me like all this bullshit math stuff that has nothing to do with anything it's like like why is there not like a talent like a tag program for like English and social studies and other things why does that have to be just math and so like the the test they gave me was like completely like unfairly hard and so they're like, nope, nope, you're not in there. It's like, okay, you do realize I'm only like the fucking third grade, right? And you're giving me like ninth grade math. Cause that's that's fair. That's that's really a nice measuring stick on whether I'm talented and gifted. If I can do sixth grade, sixth grade's higher's worth of math. 
parents. Like, not like, uh, you know, I'm like fucking eight years old. Wow, that was a nice ass pitch. Okay, so another prize car in the bank here. Plus, we just won this little tournament that they had going on here, so that's exciting. I'm very happy about that. So what have we? What do we? Uh, what did they give us this time? That's gonna be worth an ass, an ass load of, uh, an ass load of spondulia. What? A cure? The cure R33. Another skyline. I mean, I, I definitely don't need this, but it was sick to have for 10 seconds before I sold it. So there it goes. Cause we got we got this awesome Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexel skyline last time. So there's that. All right. Oh shit! I have to, I have to change cards again. <laughs> so what we're going to be attacking the uh, Pacific League with is going to be the GT40 race car. We'll jump in there. What year was it made? 1969. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, we're already in there. So let's jump inside. That's what she said. And then. Even though I don't think she would have said that, but she did because I said so. Off to midfield. Let's see what we can do here. Get one little race out of the way, I think. We'll probably have enough time for that. I don't know why I thought that for some reason we were going to be able to just knock out all three of these in, one, in this episode. Ooh, okay. See, they're giving us at least something a little more worthy of my time. I, I, saw, I saw that Dodge Viper up there. I don't think I didn't see it. And there's that, that Corvette right there. And we got an RX-7. What are these other cars we got here? Ford Mustang and an NSX. See, those those are those are going to be worthy for a minute. I mean, I'm still going to kill these guys because I just am. I mean, we're using we're using another touring car here. So it's going to be a little bit unfair. I mean, I'm still going to kill every single one of these guys by a lot, but at least I'm, you know, racing against cars that it, it just it feels like they're more worthy of my time. It just does. Like, a Dodge Viper, GTSR, just, it seems more normal to be, you know, racing in, like, an actual big league thing. Other than just, like, these little, little itty-bitty European cars that just, you know, getting totally slammed by the man here. God, look how big those tires are. Those things are just monstrous back there. Ah, shit. No! No! You know that feeling that you get when when you eat popcorn and you get one of those little kernels like spot welded into the back of your teeth? I totally got that going on right now. Fucking A. By the way, popcorn with brewer's yeast and a little bit of Parmesan cheese. Oh! 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 Yeah. Orgasm noises. That's that's what that is. It's actually really good. I, I just found this out a little while ago, but yeah, brewer's yeast and popcorn. So good. Holy shit. Dude, calm yourself. Alright, well I guess we're going to spin out like 90 bajillion times here. We're just going to do that because apparently I wanted to make it interesting and I have to scratch my eyeball. Not actually my eyeball because that would really hurt. But I had like something in my eye. I had something in my viewing stocks. And see you later. Thanks for playing. This car is so weird. It's so quiet. It's just like, it's like this, the weirdest car. Like, usually for a car that has a lot of horsepower, it's usually like, I got a lot of horsepower, listen to me! But not this one, it's just like, I have a lot of horsepower, but I'm so quiet. <laughs> just like that, it's actually just like this little... Looks like there's a little itty bitty preteen in there making making the noise of the engine. Like you can't even hear this thing. It's so weird. Like I'm I'm actually like intently listening for this thing and I can't even hear it. It's just ah, oh, it's it's so weird. Like you don't expect that. You expect to hear just this loud. I'm going to assert my you know dominance over everybody just because I am fucking fast type of thing. Alright, we're going to be careful here, because we're definitely not winning by as much as I thought. These guys are definitely being a little more competitive than uh, than in previous installments here. So i gotta, I got to be careful here. I can't afford to spin my damn car out again. I just I have, to be, have, to, I have to be cautious of the of the uh, the situation at hand here. We're still going to win, and we're, I want, I'm actually really... I'm really excited about what prize cars we're going to win here, because... They're, uh, they're obviously giving those out now, so the, the big thing is, I just want to know, you know, 
if we're gonna get like maybe like another rally car if we can get like another rally car out of this that would be really cool because the uh, the Ford Escort one that we have it, it's nice I farted <laughs> it's nice to have but it's it's only gonna last us for so long it's, it's definitely not gonna be one that's going to you know take us the distance here so you know we're, we're it's, it's gonna be really important that we have a second one to work with whether that happens or not I don't know We'll figure that out as, as time goes on. I think that also, I know you guys are going to hate it. I know you are, because I'm going to hate it too. But I think that once we get done with uh, with the uh, the Gran Turismo League, so everything that we're doing in this area here, because there's one area after what we're doing right now. So I think once we get done with that, um, we are going to do another endurance race. I know, I know. Endurance races suck, but they are an important part of the game. There you go. Nice little seeing eye single. Right up the old kanji there. Oh, I have a... Somebody re retweeted me. Oh, no, somebody's following me. Well, that's nice. That's all fine and dandy. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, Gotta get that fucking... Hang on, my teeth. God damn it. Ow. Son of a bitch. I didn't even get it out either. I just, you know, spent 15... Ooh. Ooh. I like that. That's quite nice. It's kind of weird looking, though. This is, like, not the type of car that I would have seen turned into a race car. But, hey, I, I don't have a problem with it. I mean, it's nice to have. I think we might actually be able to use that, too. Because uh, I think there's, like, a Nissan uh, manufacturer race that we need something like that for. I got a bad feeling that this game's gonna freeze in just a second here, so um, just in case that that happens, we're going to uh, use a save state here, and then uh, yeah, cause it's making that weird noise in the back. It's doing that thing that it does, doing that thing you do, making fucking weird noises, and then you're crashing. But I think we're gonna be okay this time. Yeah, that noise went away, so it's all good. Yeah! Look at this. So now we're out here in Seattle. This damn place. We've had plenty of, you know, problems here, too. Plus, we just we just did an endurance race here, so that was also incredibly annoying. Because I had to do this same fucking race, like, four times. And so, you know, I did, like, a hundred laps or more in this godforsaken wasteland. But at least it's only three it's only three laps and we're gonna be just fine. There we go. I mean I could have totally used this uh, this car in here too now that I think about it. I mean I, I definitely use the uh, the Dyson the Dyson Sylvia. but uh, I definitely could have used this here too because this car has pretty decent handling as far as uh, races like this are concerned. So I could have done it. I obviously didn't, because I just didn't, but I, I could have. I really could have. This car actually does have really good handling until that moment right there. And that would have been the defining moment of why I didn't do that. <coughs> because the Sylvia definitely did a much better job in that department of not spinning out all the fucking time. There we go. I wonder what car they're going to give us next time. I'm really, I'm like, I'm really excited about this. They're giving us all these really high-powered cars in this. It's, it's really fucking cool. Because we're just going to make a whole shitload of money for pretty much nothing. Alright, well, we're making pretty quick use of that. Well, Patrice, remember, is it a better new Oh, oh, no, don't... God damn it. Okay, yep, that's the exact reason why I didn't use this car for this race. Because it's already spun out twice over the course of just a little over one lap, and that's that's just not going to cut it. Hey, see you later, Dom. No, don't. God damn it! All right, yep, I'm official. Whoa! Jeez, <laughs> that guy just got catapulted into the wall. That was funny. Uh, enough of enough of the God! Stop it! Jesus Christ! Why are you 
flipping out so much. Calm down. Dude, this, this thing is having a struggle here right now. It shouldn't be because it was just like totally tearing everybody's condoms off like just one race ago. And now all of a sudden it can't handle that. Come on. Let's go get back in the lead again because that's what we're supposed to do. Enough of this little false hopes thing. There's no reason to ever give Vin Diesel hope for anything. Because he doesn't deserve it. See? That's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to just turn and be normal. Not do this weird, oh, oh, oh I'm gonna spit out because it's fun. There we go. Now we're gold. Stay gold, pony boy. You see, like, there's no reason for the second lap being slower than the first one. The first one, we started at a standstill. The second lap, we started, like you know, going 130 miles an hour. Should not have a slower second lap ever. But we did, because that's that's what happened. But we're gonna be okay now. I'm gonna I'm gonna be a little more cautious here, gonna take it slow. There we go. Hey, did they hit a home run? Oh my god, they hit a homer! He hit a homer! Wham! Another homer! See, this is what happens. Mississippi State being fucking awesome for just just a day. That's that's all that's all I really wanted. Just wanted them to be cool for a day, then I can go back to hating them. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, suck on that, Andrew Moore, you little jizz bag. Bingo. Okay, now we've got a nice little lead here. Like I'm kind of wondering if this if this band ever made any other songs that were like that people knew about other than this one. Because I don't even first of all I don't even know who it is that did this song in the first place. But I would enjoy knowing if this band made any other songs that I knew about because this song is awful. It really is. It's just it's not a good song at all. Wow, that was a good laugh. That was like. Like, for all the endurance races that I did, I think that would have been, like, in the top five for best laps that I've done. Dude, that was a damn good hit. That guy cremated that thing. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo! Yep, they're teeing off on him now. That game, my friends, is going to be over pretty soon. Alright, well, we got ourselves another new car. A new car. Ah, let's go see what they're putting in there because we are out of time for this episode, but when we come back on the next installment of Let's Play Gran Turismo 2, we're going to be going to Laguna Seca, and also, uh, that will be, like, episode 71, I think, and that will be tying the record on my channel for longest Let's Play series of all time. An RX, ooh, well, that's kind of cool. And it's a Racing Edition one, so... That will take precedence over this other one that I've got. I have I had one around here somewhere. I don't know where the fuck it is, but it's here somewhere. Where is that thing? Where's that RX-7? I had one. I don't know where it is. I didn't sell it, did I? I can't imagine that I did. Maybe I did. I guess I did. Or did I? No, there it is. There you are. Well, I can officially get rid of you now, because I don't need you. Because I've got the racing edition of you now, so hardy, hardy, har. Alright guys, so when we come back next time, where are we sitting on completion? 43.9%. Doing quite well. So, yeah, when we come back, we've got another set of nationals to get out of the way. And we will. We will. With interest! So you guys take it easy. This is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.